Hello everyone. Today we'll be going over how to create a tripwire rule and adjusting the recording schedule in your recorder to record the event. For this to work, you will need a DVR or IP camera that supports intelligent video surveillance or IVS feature. You can verify if your device supports this feature on the product spec sheet. The first step is to access the interface of the DVR or NVR that has the cameras connected to it. There are two methods you can use to reach the IVS parameters to create the tripwire or intrusion field rules. Simply using the local interface of the recorder or accessing the web interface of the recorder using a web browser. The local and web interface are basically the same, so the process is very similar. For this demonstration, we'll be using the web interface. Once logged into our system, we will navigate to the parameters section in the AI settings. Go to Main Menu, AI, and Parameters. In the Parameters section, we want to open the Smart Plan tab and enable IVS for each channel that we plan to create a rule. Next, we will open the IVS tab and select the channel from the drop-down menu. Clicking the plus symbol will add a rule to the channel that needs to be configured. Double-click the type and select the type of rule you want to create. You'll notice that depending on the type of rule you select, the parameters underneath will alter. A tripwire rule will have the option to select the direction that a target must cross the line to trigger the rule, and an intrusion field will have the option to select if the target crosses into the field or appears in the field to trigger the rule. You can select between human, vehicle, or both as the effective target for the rule. The schedule allows you to set a time frame for the rule to operate, but we suggest leaving it on the default schedule so that the rule operates 24-7. The post-record setting will set the system to continue recording the trigger event for the specified amount of time, and the record channel setting will tell the system which channel to record the trigger event when the rule is triggered. Now we will draw a rule on the image of the camera. For a tripwire, you may need to add multiple joint points to create a rule to best capture the target. When you're done drawing the rule, right-click with your mouse and the rule will be completed. Drawing an intrusion field is similar. Simply draw a field on the image and right-click to complete the rule. After adding the rules to your liking, make sure to click the Apply or Save button at the bottom of the screen. Now that we have the rules added to our channels, we'll need to adjust the recording schedule to record the intelligent events. To accomplish this, we'll need to go back to the main menu and navigate to the record schedule settings. Going to main menu, storage, and schedule. At the top, we will select all channels in the drop-down menu. Next, we will adjust the schedule to record intelligent events for the whole day, for every day of the week. Now the system will record every time any of the rules are triggered, and will display a blue mark on the timeline when viewing playback. And that's all for today. We hope this video has been helpful in utilizing all of the features of Elite Series Systems. If you have any other questions, feel free to visit our website at securitycameraking.com. And as always, have a great day and stay safe.